Good morning. I got a brainstorm this morning since I was up almost all night. Uh, come to think of it, uh, I must have had a fever because it, uh, I woke up in a puddle of sweat, went up and took me a warm shower, changed my bedding, and I feel a lot better. But something that I gotta go pay my fine today, but I have a great brain, what they call brain fart. Since that police officer said I was old, they uh, they award the elderly for being old. First thing they get they get uh, you can ride the shuttle for free. It takes you to your doctor's appointments, your dentist appointments, your uh, Grocery store, uh, whatever else it was, your pharmacy appointment, uh, your lab appointment. In other words, they shuttle you around. Your own taxi service, and it's free. So, that's just part of it. And since that woman gave me some food yesterday, I thought to myself, hmm, why am I cooking? They give us uh, meals on wheels. That's what they call it. Meals on wheels. And I'm entitled to that. And I'm entitled to go into the secret, uh, what do they call it? Uh, soft sneakers. Anyway, to the gym. They'll haul you back and forth to the gym. And it's free. Like Golden Spa or whatever the hell they call that shit. Golden Gym. But that's just part of it. I found out the other day that, you know, I told you my granddaughter had to quit work because she couldn't afford to pay the babysitter. And uh, with four little old kids and work, but she was almost getting $30 an hour. And they hadn't filled that position. Well, you know, I worked in a lab for like 40 years. And I'm thinking, hmm, maybe I can fill that position. I dug out my certificates. Yeah. And I've kept my license paid up. It's like $40 a year. My lab license, I've kept that paid up. Be like having CDLs, but I went ahead and kept it just so I could have the card. And hmm, I could go back to work. And that the only part I hated about work was the drive up there and the drive back home. But since I got access to the shuttle, it takes you to all your lab appointments. Well, I, they could take me to that lab every morning and take me home every evening. They run from 6 o'clock in the morning to 6 o'clock in the evening. And I would be working from 9 to 5. Yeah. I still got to dig out the rest of these things. They got my old resume. And, uh, hell, they just give me $20 now. What do I care? <laughs> I and now the big question is, uh, I can't stand on my feet for eight hours a day. But I got a perfectly good wheelchair. I can sit for eight hours a day. I do it here in this chair all the time. So I could use that wheelchair. That way, the can't discrimination against the elderly or the handicapped. And I got all the qualifications to work in a lab. 
I was digging all these things out yesterday. Certificate of completion. This certificate is awarded to me. So there you go. All these people got PhDs and all the other crap. So, I can get all my paperwork ready. I gotta go pay that ticket first. And then go pick up the medicine. And I know I can pass the drug test uh, because uh, the drug test says that you can, the medicine you're taking by prescription is still legal. So that, that'll pass. And what I'd be doing in that lab is what she did. It's all she did was. People that came in there for, like, jobs, or they said the policeman sent them over there, or they did drug testing is what they did. That's all the hell they did. And that's about the easiest shit to do in a lab, the drug test. And I get a free ride up there and a free ride home. And then the Mills on Wheels can bring me my supper. I believe that's good. That's what I'm thinking. Tell me if I'm wrong, people. I gotta find the rest of these things. I got a bunch of in frames. That's what I gotta do. In fact, it was good that I got a ticket. I would have never thought about that. I've always, always been independent. I guess I could go back to work at 90. My, my YouTube channel don't do no good. <laughs> But I guarantee you, I'm on my way around the centrifuge. Yep, and a microscope. Yep, hell, if I work five years, shit, and I can still draw my social security and my pension. Well, Biden's got us made. That's what I'm up to this morning. See, I always get up early anyway. I'm thinking. I got the hiccups already. I was thinking, I need all my certificates, all my degrees, my resume. And a free ride. Yep. And if that falls through, I'm sure there's somebody else out there. Go back to work for the water company. That way well, we may have enough time to work. That's five days a week, 40 hours a week. And I even get insurance. <laughs> Yeah. I don't see why they wouldn't hire me. I clean up pretty nice. I can put my suit on. Ugh. I bought a bunch of these at the dollar store. Because they don't last me very long. I break them for some reason. Yep, yeah, that's what I've been doing, digging out certificates. I 
higher achievement of science. Well, okay. Yeah, I can work as a chemist. I started to do that one time at a paint company. I invented the uh, the fungi paint, kill mo. Yeah, that's mine. Uh, all you do is put damn poison in paint and roll it on the wall. Keeps down algae, fungus. Yep. And the black mold. I feel pretty wired up this morning. I had a fever, I guess, because it broke last night. Yeah, I feel pretty good this morning. Took me a warm shower. Get off all the sweat. And throw the laundry and the bedding in the laundry hamper. I got to redo that today. First, I'm gonna go though and get my ticket paid for, and then give that place a call, make an appointment to get an interview. Then I'm gonna call Mills on Wheels. Call the shuttle company, and uh, I know the hours they run because Gladys uses it. Six in the morning, six to the six at night, and they don't have. They can't ask you a bunch of questions as long as they're dropping you off at a lab or a doctor's office or Walmart for groceries. And a pharmacy, they don't care. They get paid by the government. And Mills on Wheels, I, I'm in a wheelchair 90% of the time, so hell, I, I, I qualify for that. Got to call find out all about this stuff today. Get me an appointment. Take my resume, all my paperwork. If I get that job, Katie bar the door. What in the world is this say? That's all I've got to do going. I'll let you go, talk to you later. I appreciate all my new subs. Who says you never get too old to figure things out? Hell, I ain't ready for the rocking chair in the old folks' home yet. I get bored sitting here all the time. Uh, nothing to do but make jewelry and paint paintings. Hell, I only worked six months to a year. Hell, look at there. Look at the money I had. Buy me a new Winnebago. <laughs> Talk to you guys later. I'll let you, I'll keep you informed. Pour all these old certificates. Yep, I dig all them paperwork out. Talk to you later. Wish me good luck.